Flame here, and welcome back to another CJ the Champ reaction. Today, reacting to, this is going to be my favorite, another favorite video of mine, is the second, the sequel, the continuation of the Ryuga Trials, and I'm excited. Why? Because Ryuga is one of my favorite freaking characters. And he's going to talk about Middle Masters, which arguably is probably the best middle, the best season out of the Mega Saga. And probably overall, because Masters was crazy. Cool. OP. They meet <laughs> Team US, <laughs> the villain. I'm like, I can see why we're the bad guys. I can see that. I can see that. <laughs> but anyways, he's just going to be on straight demand time. So Let me then the, the king came out. So you would have to think this man is the king of his village. So yeah. no way he could be sorry, right? Was this Fury? No. It... Was this Fury or was this Masters? It's trash. No, that's Mas That's Fury. The only thing I do hate is that Metal Fusion was the first season. All then right, Metal Masters second. Then Middle Welcome Fury. Back. To the right. It's the third season. I'm like, right. they could have picked some different. And ladies and gentlemen, letter? we already know what's up. After the longest exhibit eight in round table yes. history, and with a whopping score of one Medio. sixty-one, I have this bay. Submit the legacy of the greatest nigga to ever wield a spinning top. Media, so y'all already know we got all the rest of the evidence on deck. The ranking system is yep. ready to rock and roll. The new so bay. Further ado, Let's go. Exhibit B. B. Bum bum. Yeah, already, ladies and gentlemen. I now upgraded his bay. Exhibit B. Return of, of the, the goat. goat. Now, ah. as we know, Ryuga suffered the first loss of his career off of some bush because we ah. know in anime the power of friendship is undefeated. But so Pegasus was made to counter Ryuga. Loses, He's gone. Fall off. I mean, it no. to the best of them. But True. Ryuga? Nah. Shit. After nah. this man lost, this man went straight back to the lab in a boiling hot volcano. And bro was serious about mm -hmm. never getting hold ever Facts. again. This man trained his ass off, overcame the dark power, and unlocked Meteo, Meteo El, El Drago. Drago. And boy, oh boy. <laughs> yeah. Nobody is fucking with this. I'm going to just go nah. ahead and tell you that now. So now we move on to Italy. And we have our sights set again on Subasa. Now we all remember that bro got booed. Yes. Completely annihilated. The dark power. Bladers. Overload, take over. Bro did not just get put in a coma. No, this brother got immense PTSD. Yep, and possessed. Infected, bro. You know what? This mm -hmm. is a whole point, bro. He literally yeah, transmuted a whole disease <laughs> to this nigga. So, infected Subasa ends up pulling up on Team Excalibur and is straight up yeah. trying to Team murder UK. him. But while they're fighting, they end up hearing something in the distance. <laughs> oh, did you all hear that? <laughs> Speaking of go. <laughs> look at this nigga. Meteors is walking in with a meteor shower. And bro wasn't yeah. even done. He just summoned his bay as a meteor and just blew up the whole area. Open a stadium. A crater. This right here might be one of the greatest entrances of all mm -hmm. time. But we ain't gonna I forget agree. the fact of that. That is a massive amount of environmental damage, my nigga. Like this man was this close to probably. He misspelled environmental. <laughs> but look at him, bro did not come to play games. Dude immediately just starts a recap. Yep, the well. These two flying. The well, yeah, the grand set has. Said, ah, El Draco, cut that nigga. Gravity Ooh, destroyer. Is boomed. And the yeah. fact that he just watched these two with ease is just wild. Because Team Excalibur are basically the Euro top League four. champions. And he yep. watched them in under 30 seconds. They were so top Julian four. come to save his teammates from getting thrashed anymore. And the thing is, Julian's Bay has reverse rotation as yeah. well. And also, mm -hmm. not to mention, this nigga is a elegant asshole. For real, Julian Concern. Say, ah, that's a nice toy you got there, buddy. The thing Where'd is, get that Ryuga cannot steal. Damn, that's so crazy. Cannot steal. Spin. He leaves, he tells him. Remember this, spin steal another ass. left there can spinning only be bay. One. one reverse rotation bay in this world, and it belongs to me, the GOAT! Yeah. Well, there'll be, so after turns that out to be more, but whatever. This man travels to America, and he's somewhere just in the Grand Canyon. Yeah. So these soldiers come up and tell yeah, him, Yeah, the military. Put your hands in the motherfucking air, or we gonna boom your shit, nigga. And they <laughs> dot sights, the lasers, and everything. They look like they're really about to kill this man. But, but not. This confrontation he tosses his bay from his hands. He's on a different level. He doesn't else, launch it. I kid you not, this man laughed and threw out his bay 
with his bare hands. Is this nigga serious? He this is. Nigga don't even need the launcher no more. No, he don't. Obviously, the soldiers are pissed. Nigga, this is premium disrespect. This is the equivalent to bringing a knife to a gunfight. So True. they end up shooting at him, and their base keep on hitting his, but all that is just making El Drago rotate even faster, and their uh -huh. impending doom more Spin stealer. It was over for them. All five of them get flown. Yeah, them boys are dead. Let's be honest. Them niggas got baked. But a man in a hood Farts. ends up stopping his attack. And it is none other than Zesty Jack. Jack. So Jack, Jack yeah. ends up taking Ryuga to Hades City Evil and Befall brings him to HD like Academy, Was which it is Evil basically Befall? a developmental academy for bladers. And it is ran by none other than, than Dr. Zuggernaut. Ziggurat. So Ryuga oh, mad Ziggurat. as hell, because he came from and they wasted his time, and also trying to do experiments on El Drago. Look at him, bro, yeah. trying to kill Jack. Bro, it's lucky he was behind bulletproof glass. So they end mm -hmm. up making him fight Zio, who is a literal bum compared Rax. to Ryuga. So they get to letting it rip. Flame Pixis! Pushing them back. But to be fair, Ryuga did have to come over adversity in this fight. Because this man's bay was built so fucking yep, awkward. Yeah, the spin track. Fat ass spinner stim. I don't know what the fuck that is, but it's spin track. And this man Zio talking shit too. Bro saying, ha, you can't beat my big sis. Not a chance in hell. Like, bro, do you know who the f you're going against the oh, goat and brooks ass nigga so it took <laughs> like a good minute for ryuga to read bro then he told him nigga when my name come up respect it huh stop playing with my name i ain't gonna say it no more so this man pulled out his new special move and instead of shooting gala guns bros now shooting Cruzons, and blows this nigga's bay up and pins Back. it in the ground Nigga out here disrespecting the goat. Nigga, who the fuck you think you is, lil' bro? So this man, Facts. Dr. Ziggurat, ends up trying to trap Yo, this man right here. But they just pissed just, off, bro, even more. He ain't he became said, important no more in the third room. season. So, bro, blows a hole in the building to make his escape. Yeah. But this man, Dr. Ziggurat, was on straight dick. Bro was like, oh, I need that man for the my new world doji. domination. So later on that yeah. day, this man sends Zio and, like, eight soldiers to jump him in the park. And Ryuga looks completely dumb, bro told. Them. Ah, can you niggas get off my dick? I can't even breathe. <laughs> so all the soldiers end up shooting at him. But Ryuga hit the shadur on their ass. Bro said, yeah. Look at the ice on my wrist, nigga. And ah, it's so cold. And this man just caught another eight bodies. Look yeah. at them. Them boys ain't breathing. Hey, I mean, at least the family gonna have the full body intact for the funeral. Unlike that other nigga Bruh. from the training regiment. Facts. So now we move on to the world championship. And Final. The moment, Team Japan is cooked. Masamune got his arm broke. Tsubasa and you got boomed before yep, the they needed, even they, started. Yep, so they, they had need this a man third, Jenga about to carry third the whole team. So Jenga will have to face Zesty Jack next. But a meteor ends up coming in. Nah. And this man Ryuga ends up pulling up. Yeah. I actually feel so bad for her. She really got PTSD from this nigga. She oh, did. Y'all gonna have the world championship without me? <laughs> Bitch, sub me in. I'll cut this blue <laughs> lipstick zesty motherfucker in a heartbeat. So right, you Why does El Drago look garbage in that pig? And this man oh, Jack is batshit crazy. Not even gonna lie to you. This man was like, oh, I can't wait to turn you into a work of art. Yeah, turn his, turn his opponent bay base into art. Nigga. Cause he murdered Klaus. So this man and Jack Klaus pulls out his peacock and bullied Masamune. But Ryuga stood there unfazed, and El Drago completely ate it. But Jack did not let off the and pressure. And Masamune lost his Zio. I'm Ryuga like, bruh. He was carving his art in I the mean, stadium. I mean, that had to happen so Ryuga could pull up to save the day. Like, fuck wrong then Jenga to murder. So uh, this man tries to finish Damian. his work of art by trying to drill El Drago into the eye, mm -hmm. and it looked like he almost had this man. El Drago nah. was slowing down and everything. But Ryuga had this man right where he wanted him. El Drago just starts going berserk. Ryuga yeah. tells him he wasn't even trying the whole fight. So yeah, it was time to pack up Zesty Jack. So bro charges up his dragon emperor supreme flight and strangles the yeah. fuck out of his peacock and incinerates it. Mm -hmm. And to finish off that man's work of art, Ryuga shot that man's bay back into, into the, the eye. eye. And this man Jack lost his mind, bro. He was like, no, no, my work of art, my Mona Lisa. <laughs> but this man Ryuga was not done. He looked at this man, Dr. Ziggurat, yeah. looking all safe and shit in his skybox and shoots his bay and scarred him with the glass. This man yeah. Ryuga told him, get off my dick, nigga. <laughs> 
they won the tournament. So Ryuga yeah. Yuga technically is now the world, world champion. champion. Or just walked in the middle of the championships and left with a ring. So after the world championships, Dr. Ziggurat basically yeah. reveals to the entire Twisted world tempo. that he's a terrorist. And Hades City is a literal flying nuke. And this man is yeah. a whole arms dealer. He's trying to sell it to the country with the highest bid. And come on, we know who's going to buy that. America, fuck yeah. Um, so it it is in the U.S. Is what? Floating and is about to terrorize the world. Ryuga is just looking at it from the distance. And my God, this got to be this man's wildest feat. This man Ryuga said, fuck you, fuck your city, fuck your nuke, and fuck Skypea. Because I'm about <laughs> to make this bitch Atlantis. So this man <laughs> shoots El Draco <laughs> and blows up the damn core. And look at this nigga Ziggurat. Emergency, sir. Somebody has blown up the fucking sure, island. Sky we are about to sink. That's kind of a bar right there. It literally just Rummage ripped through. through the entire city. And that hole just started going down. It was GG yeah. for that whole city. They got lucky they even landed that hole to get everybody off the island. But yeah, mm -hmm. technically, bro sunk this whole island. So this is property damage to the absolute max. It's, this ain't yeah. no damn stadium. This is a whole city. That's a whole 50 points, bro. Yep. All right. It's time for a legendary status. Exhibit C. Exhibit C. Yes. Destructor. Yeah, I now present to you our final exhibit, a legacy of greatness. Yes, sir. To a remote village on a island that has uh -huh. experienced recent events of terror. As Jenga yep. and his friends are searching for legendary bladers, they come across this man that recounts what happened to his village. A in dragon. his words, he states, About two weeks ago, a man came here looking to infiltrate our sacred ground. He started to speak, but Go none of us could understand him. <laughs> I beg your pardon. Go to but then our village elder it. ended up realizing that he was speaking the ancient <laughs> language of Gotenese. He then forced himself into our ancient ground. Bro, he just now the ripped through a rope. We thought was we'll sleep for years. Started to awake rough. again. We angered the dragon god. So we got on our knees and glazed him for forgiveness. So yeah, if you can't tell who this is by the villagers recount, it is If I remember correctly, didn't Jenga and the gang freaking slightly turn the volcano slightly at a different degree so the lava flow turns away from the village? I'm pretty sure that happened. Most definitely Ryuga. They Obviously, this man was a literal god. god. Like they was on their knees glazing. Oh, glorious king Ryuga, please spare us. Oh, yo, this is ridiculous. First of all, he gets a point for breaking and entering on a second <laughs> yeah. round. And True. secondly, another one for terrorizing these villagers and basically True. having them in a hostage situation. So Kiyoya and Benkei end up yeah. climbing the volcano and finding him. And obviously, Kiyoya, being the smoke demon he is, deciding he Rex. wanted his rematch. That Bang Leon! Last time wasn't enough. So they start fighting, and it is just absolute chaos. While Ryuga is going absolutely berserk. And not gonna lie, you can probably guess what happened after this. Kiyoya started pressuring him for a bit, but that shit ain't working. Because Ryuga Tada has a new bay again. El Drago Destructor. Destructor. So Kiyoya gets absolutely blasted. Yep, Fang like Leon man violated. Cooked. Ryuga made this man unconscious again. And of course, here come Benke. Ah, my glorious Pookie Bear Kiyoya. <laughs> So after Kiyoya gets boomed, guess who's next up on Jenga. the list? Jenga. Jenga. The Bro protagonist. Was trying to convince Ryuga to join them on their quest, but this man did not care at all. Like, Bro nah. Said, yeah, yeah, yeah. Shut the fuck up. Whip out your bay and show me that you ain't a fraud, nigga. So they start <laughs> fighting, and Jenga starts getting blasted. Bro held nothing back against this nigga. He just kept on yapping at him. Come on, pussy boy. Show me that. What's a better name? Cosmic or Big Bang? I have no idea. Shit. So Jenga so starts I watched the, back. I watched so the dub, so it's no, no, Cosmic. No, not today. So El Drago swaps Man, no, in Japan, it's Big says, Bang. Get the fuck off me. Yeah. And Ryuga said to hell with it. And blows up the volcano. And there it is. Game set. The main character was cooked. Two on one against and Jenga. Did what Crazy. Many other characters couldn't take the set over the main character. And look at him yeah. talking ish. <laughs> I knew you were a fraud. That fucking Mickey ring. Your friends weren't here to save you this time, buddy. So right before he's about to leave, the the guy with the glasses. I forgot his him. name. Wasn't his name Yuki? I'm sorry, I'm Mercury Anubis. But this shit is embarrassing. This little nigga got his shit rocked. Yeah, bro, tries to get up with a whole power up and everything. But Ryuga looked at blood and said, Man, nigga, fuck out my face. And incinerates this little nigga. Mm -hmm. Hey, man, I guess at least he tried. <laughs>
So after Ryu could just casually body the main cast. Later on, this man heads to the Sahara Desert to a village that's yeah. having this annual tournament. So here's the announcer hyping up their strongest dude. Ladies and gentlemen, we all love him and know him. Our village's strongest man, Zernando. Zernando. And his opponent, a random traveler that just came here a day ago. Wait, wait, wait a minute. Wait, is that who I think it is? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, Lightning. Ladies and gentlemen, it's the goat. goat. And this whole tournament uh, was just cooked. The strongest dude in the village. One shot. This mm -hmm. big ass Sam Sulek built nigga got booned. And he yeah. wasn't the only one. Because every other opponent got one shot in. Nobody stood a chance. So then mm -hmm. the king came out. So you would have to think. This man is the king of his village. So nah, bro, no he looks he basic. Sorry, right? 12 seconds later. <laughs> Damn! I forgot he blew. Yeah, I ain't gonna lie, y'all need to hold a new election after that one. So then the final Kenta! opponent of this tournament was Kenta in his big ass soccer ball ass head. Every time I see this little nigga with his big ass head, I just wanna hey, punt him. But and Kenta yeah, got that uh, Gohan arc in this, this season. The rest of the main cast. Ooh. Gets made a statistic on this man's record. So after Kenta got boomed, he ended up he following him. Ryuga trying to go on a journey of self-discovery. And while they on the middle of their journey, they end up getting confronted by a tiger. tiger. But this man Ryuga was not phased. Nah. Bro walks up and mean mugs, mugs the, the tiger. tiger. He had bro shook. Oh no. Nah. Tony the tiger making the right decision to run away and live another day. Cause bro would have not been eating no more frosted flakes. His ass would have became a pelt. So Box. after this, Ryuga ends up entering another battle royale because apparently there's a legendary blader at the top of the tower. Oh, yeah. So it starts. And while and there was no running, legendary blader here. Move. Uh, he's just standing there. Man, is he? So he waits for like a good 10 minutes. So when the final 11 are up here battling, this man decides to blow a hole in the tower yep. and just knock out all 11 of them. Subasa was here, I forgot. Yet. He had to face Subasa in the finals. And I'm not gonna lie to you, this one might be worse than the last time they fought. This shit lasted for one minute tops. This man pulls out a new special move and sends his bay to the mountains. Subasa, bro, is like, uh, bro. Also, sad because Subasa became there nothing in season three. So after he sent Subasa's bait at Kingdom Come and made him take a hike, he tells the legendary blader to bring your ass out here. So bro comes out and he's like, it was a lie. Please, please, please. I, I, I'm not no legendary blader, bro. I, 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 I'm a fraud. Is this nigga serious? So this man Ryuga was pissed off. Bro went over to his bay and stepped on it. And Blood said, I don't like my time to be wasted, nigga. Mm -hmm. And this man just destroys the entire tower. This man does not get yeah. tired of property damage. And then after he blows up the tower, look at old dude crawling out the thing like, oh, never sign me up for this ever again. So after this man just destroyed the Tower of Babel, next up was Easter Island. Bro decided to I participate forgot about in Easter another I battle Easter royale. Island. And look, people ain't even fighting them. They just cowering in fear and pissing they draws because they know it's pointless. But one man decided to fight him, and that was Goku. <clears throat> I mean, AKA King. And I yes. gave Goku as a joke. No, look, that nigga is a super He changed his hair. So yep. you gotta think to yourself. King with uh, what was his bay Mars? Super Saiyan can take him down, right? Man, shut your bitch And King is a legendary blader. Yeah, he booms this. I, I don't know what to say. This nigga has cleared the whole verse, literally. So there was uh -huh. only one person that could actually take this man down. Rago. And it was no simple mortal. Nemesis. Oh, no. This man's final battle is against a god. Uh -huh. Yeah. It's gotten to this point. I mean, no mortal can hang with the nigga, so why not a god? Facts. So he starts fighting Rago, and guess who's dick eating Rago? Hello there, Master Ryu. Doji. As you yeah. can see, I found another man to glaze. Like, this nigga just hopped off dick and just went to bandwagon somebody else. So in like this Paul Heyman. Was going out with and he comes back in season four. Nukes. But over time, bro started to get his ass He started beat. glazing Nemesis Kira started and the gang. destroying this man. Like, this is literally the first time yep. you ever see this nigga with battle scars. And this man, mm -hmm. Goji, over here talking shit. Oh, yes, look at you on the ground like a worm. 
my god, how in the hell did I ever dick eat you? But this man <laughs> not about to Pause. go out like no bitch. This no. man got up. He goes a on. Legendary ass yap session. Powered up and winning for his last attack. And end up having a massive clash. And the yeah. shockwave ends up hitting this man Doji. And this man falls to his death. <laughs> yeah. Wrong, said, he if lives. I'm going out, I'm taking you with me, you fucking dick eater. But sadly, after that, this man Ryuga was cooked and broke yeah. his head with just straight Armageddon. And Ryuga takes the second loss of his career. Mm -hmm. Well, I mean, at least it was to a god of destruction. Facts. And let's plus, let's go. The Ryuga trial. And after a very long week, I'm not gonna lie, I'm about to go to sleep. So, uh, appreciate y'all. You know what I'm saying? Uh, I'll update the whole leaderboards and everything. Yes. Wait, no, he goes right here. Yes. Later, bro. But until we meet again, I'm out this hoe. Okay. But true. I mean, Ryuga went out against a gun 1v1. It took Jenga and the whole squad of legendary bladers, eight of them. Plus Cantillator, who joins in as number nine to go against Raga, because Raga was another legendary blader. So it became a 1v9. Instead of the 1v8, then 1v9. They need a Kenta to. Kenta, who took Ryuga's power, and Ryuga was like, you know what? Screw this, Kenta, kid, take my power, finish what I started! And, and they did. In season four in Shogun Steel, there was another left handed sp uh, bay. Called Dragoon. I forgot the first part of its name, Dragoon. And I think the guy was Sakyo or something. He was cool. Red hair, uh, some some blue. And people were like, it's a left dragon. <laughs> it's, it, it's like Ryuga. <laughs> ah! And, you know, people obviously with PTSD were like, no. And, which was pretty much Subasa in that season. Because Hikaru didn't show up no more in that season, did he? Did she? Yeah, I don't think she did it. But anyways, yes, Ryuga complete, and probably no more, no probably no more Beyblades, <laughs> probably not, <laughs> unless he does like a short one, with like from Surge, because the dude from Surge was the villain on Surge was kind of a demon type. He's not really a villain, he's just an antagonist. But anyways, the link to the original description, the link to the original video down in the description below. Go watch yourself, go like yourself, support. See the champ, CJ the champ. I'm still in my voice. And support me by liking and subscribing to me. See you all in the next reaction. Bye bye.